Hello Superhero and welcome back to Mario plus Rabbids Kingdom Battle and today we're going to be continuing on with World 2, hopefully finishing World 2 because of course in the last episode we made our way through the halfway point, we are now in World 2-8 and of course we have Rabbid Mario with us. Now I will be honest, I did actually get started with this battle and then I turned to see that my recorder just was like, nah, <laughs> we ain't recording today so I, I, it seems everything's working now. Of course if it isn't, you're gonna be, not going to be see, seeing this video either, but so I do just know how things are gonna happen here. I'd also upgraded a weapon that I, I'll just show you guys really quickly. All I did is, as Rabbit Peach, I got an improved secondary. It is this thing right here. So it has 80 to 90 damage, opposed to 45 to 55. It has honey damage, so pretty good stuff. Nothing super crazy, but hey, it's it's better than the base, so good stuff. Let's get started with our first battle in 2-8. It's not fun, because now we have snow tornadoes, not just desert tornadoes, we can see it's right behind us. We need to skedaddle, because it's gonna go somewhere. Um, But let's take a look at everything. As you can see, we have two smashers and three supporters, and they are not fun to deal with. So we need to be able to get into a good position and not get hit by this tornado, which is gonna go this way, so we definitely need to get Rabid Mario and uh, Mario out of the way. Maybe we could get this, get him like Kieran, just like that. Like I don't know if that that's the best idea, but it's what we're gonna try. Um, and then we'll get this out for Mario. That might be helpful. And then you, my friend. Maybe we could get you here. I wish that Mar uh, Rabid Mario could do the jump thing, but he cannot. Maybe we could just hide him here. I mean, it's not the best spot in the world, but, hmm, also there are these frozen blocks here. Now, I have to remember that frozen blocks don't do anything more than put an ice cube on their head, and they can still move and do things when they're, they're like that, so it's not worth really doing that too much. So, maybe I shouldn't, and for right now, I mean, as Rabbit Peach, I can move, but I think we're in a good position, right? Or maybe I, maybe I wanna hide right here instead. Uh, because that should be moving forward, right? So I could go ahead and end this turn. And then it's gonna move. And it's gonna move straight across. Yes, so it's not gonna hit us. It might actually hit that supporter. Awesome, I'm really glad to see that. And he has the frozenness on his head. So once again, he can still move and do things, but. So these guys, since they can't go through this way, they're gonna take the long way around, which is really good for us. Uh. They damage boosted somebody there. I looked at like the supporter, which is actually a good idea because their supporters are gonna be able to lob their grenades over the, the walls here and make this really not fun to deal with. Oh boy. So that hurts and then immediately gets rid of some of my plans. Okay, so really we wanna take care of the supporters. We're not in the best position in the world to do that. And is Mario gonna be frozen now? He is not, but we can't freeze these guys now, which sort of stinks. Man, yeah, the supporters are like super duper the worst. Oh, yeesh. That is awful, like that's really bad. Has this Smasher moved? I really hope he has. Uh, yes, he has, okay, thank goodness. All right, so does my heal reach all three of these guys? Because I'm gonna need it to. Yeah, let's heal everybody up. And then, I'm gonna go to Mario and power boost everybody. And then I'm gonna go as Rabbit Mario here, and I'm definitely gonna like, slide attack you, and slide attack you, and Come back somewhere and, and like hop off of you and, oh no, I have a little battery, that's not good. That's actually really bad timing. Oh no, 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 no. I don't like that. Um, I don't know what I can do about that. Cause I, like, I just, you know, obviously I just started the recording. I probably should have charged it. I wish I had a pro controller right now, but I do not cause they're too dang expensive. Okay, so I could have you do this, but then you would really hurt everybody else. So I'm not gonna do that just yet. Maybe I could work on getting everybody else out of the way. For right now, I can't slide attack more than one person. So I really wanna slide attack you first because I can't slide attack and land on somebody. So we should do the thing that's gonna do more damage. Just maybe, maybe wait, 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 wait. The tornado's gonna go straight across again. So as long as I'm not in the place where I was, you know, like where it was before, I should be fine. So let's hop off of you. Hop off of you. That was good. And now, uh, Rabbit Peach, you're right here. I can slide tackle you and then I can slide tackle Yoon. That's not gonna do enough to take you out, but from here I can maybe hide like over here, and I don't think this'll be in the path, or maybe I should go like here. No, I shouldn't do any of that because, you know, maybe I should just hide way back here. Like, even if it doesn't give me too much advantage, the smasher is gonna have a hard time getting to me, and that'll be good. So now, Yoon, 
blast him full on, and actually a little bit of that supporter in the back, so that's good. And we're all still damage boosted from Mario, and it was a critical, which is great. So that Smasher didn't have a chance. Um, I could try to call people over, but I just don't know if I really, really want to right now, so maybe instead we'll just do Bodyguard. And then as you, we could just blast you, or we could really blast you, or we could really blast you. See, this is 96 to 100 damage. That would do even better. Let's do it, because the, the, the sooner I can take care of these supporters, the better. And it wasn't critical, that's what I was looking for. Awesome, awesome stuff. So I don't think we can do anything more. Like, Mario can't hit anybody from here, and, and we actually don't want him to, I don't think. Anyways, let's go. So, Tornade's gonna go back through the way it did, right? So it's gonna end up where it started in turn one. So far we're doing okay. We haven't taken too much damage, we've healed everything we've taken. I don't know how long the uh, Switch controllers last after uh, they start getting low on battery. Can you, are you gonna smash that? No, you're not. I thought he was gonna smash that and freeze himself too. Not the case. So he's gonna go over here and he's definitely gonna lob that grenade. Oh gosh, there's more popping up. Wait, how many are we supposed to defeat? Defeat six enemies. We only defeated two so far and there's only five on the field. So this additional one is gonna be something we need to deal with for sure. And so maybe, who should I land on here? Maybe you? And then maybe just like, oof, I don't know. Hmm, I could, oh, actually I got some combos for days, cause I could land here, hammer the both of these dudes, and that'd be fine. So let's go ahead and try that, boom. And then, hammer smash both of you fools, just like this, and that should destroy you, and, and get rid of the, or at least get a good chunk of health out of the other one, so that's good. Goodbye. <laughs> Awesome. Now let's pick up those coins. So as Rabbit Mario right now, I could actually run over here, slide tackle you. The only problem is it will hurt Mario a little bit. I think like that's sort of the least of my worries in a lot of ways. And then I could just sort of, where could I set up that might be good? Like where I could hurt him, but he might not be able to hurt me. Hard to say, but hopefully here, I mean, I don't know. Well, it would freeze him as well, so that could be good. Boom, we'll hit Mario for 21 damage. It isn't too bad. And then, yeah, I can smack you with this. It doesn't get him in the red, but it will get him frozen. And maybe that's a good thing. Let's see, oh wow. So yeah, he's not charging over. Hmm, okay. Well, I'll get you to hide right here. I will get you to get your shield up just in case he does charge you for whatever reason. All right, so we're doing okay, we're doing okay. We're making it work, we're making the dream work. All right, that's almost 70 damage. Yeesh, I don't like how close you're getting down. And then maybe I could call you back over this way. Maybe that's a little too close, I don't know. Oh, where's the tornado gonna go? Okay, it's gonna go, no, it's gonna hit Mario, isn't it? I didn't think about the tornado. No, no, no. Oh, oh okay. That's weird. <sighs> um. So another, oh no, another Smasher popped out. Oh, that's bad. Oh, that's really bad. I hope he isn't gonna be able to do enough to knock us out, but he might be able to. Um. Oh, but he criticaled his own friend there, which took him out, okay. I don't care how he gets taken out, he just needs to be taken out. So this supporter healed himself, but honestly, that's not the biggest deal in the world. Mario got frozen there, so I don't know what he's not gonna be able to do. I don't think too much, to be honest with you. Um, so I could do this, and then maybe just, oof, I don't really know entirely how I wanna do this. Uh, hmm. Cause we need to destroy him and then that supporter, right? I feel like, I don't know, I don't have too many strategies this time around. Oh well, I'm doing what I can. Now as Rabbit Peach, what could I do? I could just, I could walk over there. I can't slide attack him though, so it might not be worth doing that. And then instead, hmm. Mario could go over here, through the pipe, slide attack this dude, and then if I were to stand here, and I'd still be able to attack him full on. And then like, once I go through a pipe, I can't go back through on that same turn, which is actually sort of weird. Uh, I could just go like this and blast him, and maybe I'd do enough. I don't know, maybe that's really silly. 
<laughs> la 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 la. Uh, and then let's go for it. Maybe we could do enough to take him out. Maybe not. Critical? No critical. Only 74 damage then. Okay, so Rabbit Mario is really taking a beating. Rabbit Peach hasn't moved yet, but can't do too much more than what she's done. Maybe I could do this. Because we really need to make sure Rabbit Mario doesn't get too beat up here. And so he's going to move closer. And then Rabbit Mario can maybe attack him. Maybe we should have Rabbit Peach attack first. So, like, slide attack him. That'd be good. Then have her just come back here. Boom. That's 30 damage. And then Rabbit Mario, do your worst. It isn't gonna be your absolute worst, and you're still probably gonna be taken out here, so we're probably not gonna get this perfect. Which stinks, especially when I keep forgetting about the tornado. That might hit Rabbit Mario, it won't, but yeesh, that was close. Oh. oh no. I really don't like how they can pop out of the ground and move on the same turns. Like, how am I supposed to have strategy for that? All right, well, goodbye, Rabbit Mario. It was nice knowing you. That's the worst. It's the worst ever. And then you're gonna be able to hit Rabbit Peach, thanks. Are you gonna have a double attack? You're gonna get a critical, so it's just about the same. Oh, come on, come on. We just need to destroy one, no, we, need to, we still need to destroy two more, don't we? Oh, gosh. I need to get as close as I can to over here, and so why don't we just like slide tackle you in the meantime? Go over here, and then just blasting you out right should do enough. Boom, come on, come on. Nice, and was a critical. I could've used that critical earlier game. I didn't need it now. Oh, I hate when the game does that. It's like, you don't need the critical now. You could've used it earlier, so let me taunt you with it. And then we'll just slide tackle you. It won't be enough to take you up, and then I'm gonna hammer you for extra gear. No! No, I'm not ready for this. Ah, oh, come on. Okay, I'm back. I just recorded like other videos in the meantime on my, uh, remote, my re remote's charge. So at this point, Trying to remember where I am, what I've done. Oh yeah, that's right, Rabbit Mario's taking out G-Thanks game. Um, wait, so Rabbit Peach has already done what she can do for this round? Oh yeah, okay, all we need to do is take this dude out then. Okay, okay, we can do that, we can do that. Uh, Mario, go through this pipe, go through that pipe, slide attack him, and then just blast him with a hammer. Sure, why not? Okay, and then this mission is done. It's, it's not perfected, but it's done, and that's nice. I'll have to go back and do it. I don't know if we'll do that later this episode, but we'll have to see how quickly we can get to the boss fight and everything. But for right now, you're taken out. And that's a golden shot, cool. So there we go, we are done. Red Mario doesn't look pleased. I wouldn't be either, because he got hit in the face multiple times by a smasher. Okay, we did it, we survived. Give me these coins, and there's no secrets, right? There are no secrets we're missing out on. Before we get into the next battle for sure, because once, like now, uh, Rabbit Mario is at 10 health, so I guess you know, there's something to get back, but that means we have probably another battle before we're done here, which is just pleasant, just pleasant. So I need to um hit that red thing, rock it back over here. Okay, this should be a simple puzzle to solve, and it'll give us a mushroom. So that'll be good. Hmm. Let's get over there. Like this, Whee! And then we can push this thing like that, like this, like that. Okay, that should be good. Yep, we get a free item, probably just like a 3D model or something silly, but more importantly, we get a mushroom that I desperately, desperately needed. So let's get that. It really didn't do too much for uh, Rabbit Mario there, but we did what we could. I mean, at this point, if Rabbit Mario is just gonna go into a battle with 80 health, I think that we just need to reset up our team here. I think we need to go to our team selection and get some other characters in. So let's go Mario, and we could do Luigi, Rabbit Luigi. I know it's not the best setup, but what really can I do in this situation then? Um, when it comes to who we have then, Luigi could use an upgrade. I mean, the thing is, is like Luigi's massively underleveled is a problem. Okay, I might wanna just make it then Mario, Rabbit Peach, Luigi. Let's try that instead. If we go to our weapon selection, we can't buy too many upgrades for any of them, but we have decent setups for now. Looks like we can get something that's more damaging than what we have, but not by a huge margin. So right now, let's just go to our skill tree. Mario has 30 points. Once again, I don't think I really need to get too much for him, but Luigi, them. What can we get with 50 points? Probably something good, right? We can either get, like, increase Luigi's maximum number of health. That might be helpful, especially for this specific situation where he really needs more health. So let's go ahead and get him more health. And then we will, uh, enter this battle. I mean, Mario and Rabbit Peach still aren't looking too good, but, but she can immediately throw out a heal. 
Set all be good. So we're back to the original setup we did through the majority of World 1. I still like grabbing Mario a lot and would like to use him more, but he got taken out. So um, for right now, this is what we got. I'm going to instantly as Rabbit Peach. Heal everybody. Even if Luigi doesn't need it, that's fine. Now, I could do Rabbit Peach. I could like slide attack you, go through this pipe, and not do too much more. But I could slide attack you and what are you doing, camera? Uh, go through here, and it's about the same. Okay, but that's a, that's, a, that's a smasher. This is a shield dude. So there is only four enemies to defeat. They're very large and intimidating enemies that make me want to cry, but enemies nonetheless. So why, why don't I just go ahead and then try to hide somewhere smarter, like here. So boom, slide attack you. Now, as her, I could go ahead, set this up, but not make it attack her, but attack him, but attack this guy. So let's try that. Um, This guy has a lot of health. But what we really could do before anything else is, if I do this, this doesn't you know get protected through the shield in any way, which is good. Because I could just land here. And, so if I'm gonna do that, why don't I go ahead and power up, just like that. And then I can, boom, boom, land right there. And, and then I can smack him with the hammer and maybe even just finish him off flat out right now. Let's see. Hammer is gonna get him. That's so good. He's just like, hands up in the air, he's like, I come in peace, don't hurt me, and squish. So that was a critical too. So even if, you know, somehow it didn't take him out, don't have to worry about that. But if that was somehow the case, wouldn't have to worry. So I could do this with Luigi. Yes. Okay, so Luigi, if I put you here, and you're not gonna be able to see the enemy, but if I put you here, actually, you can. Ooh, that might be good. Let's do this. Your power boosted as well this turn, so we definitely wanna make your shot count. So let's go ahead and boom, 113 damage. Hopefully you'll run into this thing, get blasted again with a critical. Luigi smacks you in the face and goodbye, Smasher. That's the kind of technicality I want to see happen in this game. So now we got these two bozos and they're the last two. So we're doing okay. Oh, Mario. Oh, Mario. Yeah, I knew ye well. Yeah, I knew ye well. Uh, I don't know if he's gonna get taken out here, but he's definitely gonna take a beating. So this one's so far, I mean, I feel like this is easier than it was last time. Okay, he might actually end up hitting his friend a little bit, a little bit, but obviously as the shield out. Once again, I still don't know the answer if we can destroy these shields or not. Um, Now Mario is honeyed though, which is a bad, bad thing. I can 100% hit you from here though, which is good. So maybe I should just focus on that for right now. Boom. That's pretty good. Of course, like, uh, Luigi here isn't a bad choice. I forgot she was still up here. <laughs> Where, where can I put her in where she'll definitely land a shot? It seems like right here. At this point, I just need these characters up in the front line to hopefully distract them from hitting Mario. Because from here, he can't move and he can't get behind them because of it. So first off, let's do that. And then just blast you. And hopefully you'll focus on attacking Peach, a rabid Peach and not Mario here. Um, And Luigi can't really do too much. Like I could get him like here. And it won't get me too much done. But, good for next turn maybe? I don't want to do that because everybody who can move has moved. I'll do this, don't think it'll do too much for me, but if the opportunity arises, you know, why not? So you, could I possibly break your shield? So far, not looking like it. We're done. Okay, just be nice, be nice, please. Oof. Actually, that didn't hit Mario, so that's really lucky there. And Mario is gonna blast you as you move and you get honeyed, that is fantastic. You are gonna blast Mario though, I just hope you don't do 121 damage, you do not. So Mario probably would have gotten taken out there. Oh, he should actually hurt, but it also damaged his friend. Okay, no taken. So this guy up here has more health. So we could just go ahead and, well actually I have to do it as Rabbit Peach, I think. Yep. So I could go ahead, do that, go down here and slide attack you and then just wait here. Let's see how that works out. Boom, you're gonna go down here and do 30 damage, nice. So 30 damage slide attacks are definitely helping us out. Then you can just blast this guy, finish him off, right in the booty. The booty shots are always the ones that hurt the worst. All right, so now, uh, Luigi, you can just walk up. I don't know exactly where, I guess here, just in case we need it. But more importantly, Mario's just gonna hop off of Luigi and then onto him and it should take him out. 
Uh, it would be cool if we could hop up here. I don't think it would be very strategically wise, but it would be interesting. Anyways, that should be good. We'll land you right here. And boom, boom, 70 damage. That's what we get. So we did win this one. We actually perfected what usually it, it does ramp up in difficulty with each one, but not this time. Battle cleared. Okay, that one wasn't bad at all. We'll have to use that setup again, because it just worked. All right, so everybody gets the proper heals. I hope our whole team gets a heal, because that's what we really need at the end of the day. Either way, we get some coins here. We're gonna look at that awful silver trophy. 700 coins, 15 orbs, that's good. Let's keep going. Let's first off, take a look at our team. Team selection, do you have, I think you'll have full health now. We'll find out in a second. Boom, boom. Continue with that combo. Rabbit Mario now has 45 of these things. He's gotta be able to do something. Uh, 50, 10, 20. This one increases the length of team jump. Hmm, they're getting really expensive. 50, 60, 70, 80, 10 for this. I don't really need that too much. I don't even know if we've properly used that yet. Not too many people have slide tackled us. Uh, pipe exit range. I might just wanna wait. I mean, we could improve our uh, movement cells, but I think it would be better in is if we wait for something like the slide tackle. Um, if we could get three of those, that's really good. So if we could wait until we have 80, that's gonna be a while from now, but who knows. Uh, let's keep going. Oh, I like this little mushroom icicle or popsicle over there. I would totally buy that if that was a real thing. So what can we do with these? Why are these just chilling here for no reason? I get it, chilling. Yeah, they, do they have any significance? There's this dude over here who's stuck. <laughs> That's funny, but I think his eyes were bigger than his stomach. That, not that I blame it. Yeah, I don't know what these are for. They don't seem to have any purpose. That's really weird to me. There has to be a reason. Oh, wait, is this? I don't know, that is so bizarre. I can't even move these ones, okay, never mind. Uh. And there's a cannon down here that we can't even access. Can we, oh no, we gotta go through the pipe. Okay, <laughs> that's pretty obvious. Get this, hit back here, it is a song. Of course, it's gonna be Ice of the Sherbet Desert. And we're going back this way, into the cannon. There's actually a cannon over there too, in the stem. Hmm, see now this is where things can maybe happen. This is a button. So all we're focused on then is pushing this in a way that's actually gonna get it there which would probably be like, not that, that's for sure. I need to get it so that it's here. What would be the best way to do that? Probably to push it like this, push it like that, push it like this. No, I did not mean that way. That's not gonna be helpful and I can't push it back that way now. Oh no. Um, That's not really what I wanted but I could maybe go back here and revert a little th few things, go like that, no, push it like that, push it like this. I guess that's not quite what I wanted. Um, hmm, I try to you know include this whole puzzle because that way if anybody else is stuck on it, they can watch this and maybe get some help. That just led me in a circle again. This one's tricky, this one's real tricky because I could do something like this, but that didn't really do anything, now, did it? I mean, yeah, and that wasn't really helpful at all. I mean, I don't think I've landed about here. Oh, this might be helpful. Not quite. <laughs> Cause it really doesn't do too much for me, now does it? Yeah, okay, what am I doing wrong here? Oh, here we go, here we go. So I just to push it back into that corner, and then like that. Okay, not too bad. That was one of the required ones, you have to do that one, so. Hopefully, you know, people figure it out without too much of a strife. It wasn't super bad, it was just a little weird. <laughs> Are they canned tuna rabbits? That's sort of gross. That's actually really gross. Oh, I missed something. I missed something. I'm gonna have to go all the way back through this gigantic pipe. Oh no, go back, go back, go back. There we go. <laughs> Probably for some 3D model. What I Completion is completion, that is gonna be, oh! Okay, definitely worth it then. We get five, 10, something like that. Cool. I'll take them. Okay, so more puzzles? More puzzles. What exactly do I need to accomplish here? I need to get it to the red thing. There's only one I can do at a time, so. I mean, maybe I could complete it with either or. I mean, it looks like 
You guys see the idea? What is over here? Um, I can't go over there. It's just a weird cactus igloo. A cactus glue. <laughs> I don't know. Um, can I go on this button? I can. So that's gonna activate these blue ones. Maybe it's solvable with each? No, it's definitely not because it just blocks away. Then what's the point of the blue one? I don't get it. Uh. Well, maybe I could do something. Oh, no, 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 I know what to do. I sort of messed it up now, though. Which is silly of me. But I just need to, oh, I see now. So I gotta, no, that's not the way I wanted to push it, game. You're pushing my buttons now. But I guess, I mean, this sort of works. I just wanted to do that, do that, do that, and then do this. There you go. See, and that's sort of better. I mean, what I might have to do to get it set up properly, oh, I think that's what it wants me to do. So I need to do like more than one of these is the thing. So like, oh, that's super time consuming. Cause I gotta go back here and set this up again. I, I think, because it depends, you know? Let's do that, hit it here and I can hit it there, but would that really help me? Hmm. I don't know. Cause if I hit it here, oh yeah, I could actually, okay. So I'm gonna hit it like this, I'm gonna hit it like that, and then what we're gonna do is we're gonna run all the way back here and, and push this there, 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 all the way around. I know, super duper slow puzzle solving. I don't know, like, this stuff is fun. It's fun to, you know, solve a puzzle or two every once in a while, but gosh darn, this much it gets a little tedious. I don't know, I mean, uh, I mean, obviously it's a strategy game. There is, it's naturally going to be about puzzle solving in some way, shape, or form, but I didn't want it to be a literal puzzle game. Okay, so, like, I feel like sometimes it is just there to pad out the length of the game to say, oh, this is a 15 hour adventure because you're gonna spend two hours of it solving silly little puzzles. But hey, you know what, all video games have their quirks. All I gotta do is that, and then push it, and then go over there and push that one, and then we're done. I mean, I guess I didn't even need to set that up, I just need to get the blue block down. There we go, another mandatory one that's actually quite difficult. I hope you're good at block pushing puzzles. <laughs> uh, Where are we going? Oh, hi, rabbit. You're cute. How's your igloo? I can't tell if that's the same rabbit or two neighbors trying to avoid each other. Probably both. Probably him role playing as two rabbits trying to avoid each other. Oh, look at this, we're at the balls already. That's actually surprisingly quick. I thought there was gonna be another level or two. Okay, so we're at the fridge. What are we gonna find in here? I mean, the little rabbit guy should still be in there, right? Oh no. No, you're much worse. It's the icicle golem, effective icebreaker. Why would, okay. Um. And he has a fridge door as a shield. He's huge. I don't like it. Hi. Oh no. Oh no. Oh no. I don't like it at all. Oh. Hey. Are you here to help? Oh, you get a blaster. You are here to help. Oh, Princess Peach is here to save the day. And she has a fire blaster. It's going to be perfect. Oh no, watch out. No. She's already frozen. Oh no, that was, was that rabid Princess Peach? Okay, well, Princess Peach steals the show. Defeat the boss. Okay. This is awesome, so we get to try out a new character too. Mmm, man. So let's check her out really quickly. She has a royal gaze when triggered 72 to 80 damage, so just like Luigi would have. Um. And then protection, heroes in range, 40% damage reduction. And that lasts for two turns. Or has a two turn cooldown, I still don't know. Um, and then she also has the Duckus. Oh, this is a grenade. And then she has the blue flame. Neither of these things we can really do too much from here, but that's fine. That is so awesome though. If we check out her, no, Tacticam. She also has, hmm. <laughs> that's about it. I was gonna see if maybe we can see how many jumps she has. Can she jump off of multiple characters? She cannot. Okay, well, she's gonna be a healing type character. She actually has more health than anybody though. She's a tank, <laughs> that's cool. All right, let's get her like around here and I'm gonna guess it's gonna work similar to the shield guys do. So we're gonna have to get characters well defended. So maybe I should get Mario a little bit farther and like here and that way uh, Princess Peach 
can actually lob her thing, and that'd be awesome. So yeah, let's get her, oh, she doesn't go quite far enough anymore. Okay, that was my bad. Um, Well, then we'll get you over here. It's not the best, but it's something. And that actually might hit him. No, if I was closer, maybe. Maybe I can make it, Ah, oh, no one around. Okay, let's activate this, might work. And then let's get you over here. Oh, maybe I should have hit her behind the barrier over there. That actually would have been like behind us right now. It might have been better. So this actually would work, but it will it land? Boom, boom. Oh, it actually does damage maybe to the shield. Oh, this is probably like a breakable shield or something. Like if we attack him, that doesn't work. Okay, good to know, good to know. All right, and we'll activate that as well. I'm sure new characters are gonna start spawning in here soon. And we can't hit anybody with Rabid Mario, so we might as well leave it with that. This is cool. Oh gosh, oh gosh, please don't land. Whoa, that landed. Okay, that's not good. So she doesn't have any healing moves. I'm actually surprised about that. Maybe there is a way for her to upgrade the healing moves, but for right now, she does not. Um, I could just move right here. Like, it might be a really bad idea, but if I could do it, like, would this hit any of them? It will not, so I really wanna land this then. Boom. Just like that. Oh, he's immune to the critical, but it's good that we got a critical. Let's, nobody, oh, we can't target him with that. Interesting. Well, we might as well try this, see if it works. Uh, If we did this, I mean, I don't know if that's gonna be that great of an idea, but we could hide here. Oh, look at this. Whoa. Oh, she has a healing land to her thing, and then she has a similar attack to Rabbit Mario. That is so cool. So she can heal. She just has to land on people. Interesting. Could I land, I can't do that to you. It would be so cool if I could, but I can't. Okay, so I'm gonna get you here. And then maybe next round I could use Ra or Mario's power boost. Would that reach Peach? It will not. <laughs> will it reach Peach? Well, we're doing really good so far. Is this really what the boss is gonna be? Because honestly, we're not doing too bad against him. Like at this point, we could win in the next turn or two. I mean, he's turning around a little bit. Who is he going for? He's actually, okay, that changes things up a good bit. Oh no, and he's gonna 100% hit Peach, that's not good. 35 damage actually, okay, that's not too much. Um, okay. So, then maybe I could jump to like here, this would be a 100% hit if I do this. Yay! And then these two have a decent amount of health. Rabbit Mario hasn't been hit a single time, so I could just go like this, land somewhere around here, like here wouldn't be too bad, but I mean, I'm just trying to see if maybe I could, I don't know, take him out this turn. Like if I land here, well, she, the problem is that he's not gonna be in the healing range, so we'll do this. It'll heal her and Mario. Boom. That is so cool, I love that. So it's gonna be 0%, but this is gonna be 100, and it will not hit Mario. It's close to, but not quite. Boom. Oh, and then he turned a little bit. Let's do some damage reduction, because we're definitely gonna need it. So maybe I should've done Mario's damage booster. That was sort of silly of me. Um. Well, I'll get around here, and I don't think this will be a full blast landed, but it won't hit our teammates, so that's more important to me, so boom, we'll hit you like that, 40 damage. So maybe I will wait until next turn even for this damage boost. But I could win right here. I don't know though, will this be a win? I'm almost hesitant to think that. Boom, 98 damage, that was a critical, and there goes his shield. So he is not done. All right, that's both good and bad, enemy's turn. And now we got some rabbits starting to pop up. Now he just has full on 500 health. I thought that was gonna be too easy. All right, so you're just gonna smash him. 70 damage is quite a lot. But that's okay, because once again, really that we can heal every single turn now. That is so good. Rabbit, I mean not Rabbit Peach, she's just Peach. I keep on calling Rabbit Peach Peach, and now I'm gonna call Peach Rabbit Peach. Is that what's gonna happen here? All right then, so what I'm gonna actually do is maybe I could get, like, okay. So how far can Peach move here? All the way out to there, right? Um, I wish I could move the camera on a little bit, I can. Um, so we're gonna get Mario here. Oh no, he has this move! Oh no, ow, that hurt. Actually not a ton. So he's not very much so a heavy hitter. Um, I can get you here. He has no shield now, so we can hit him super hard. So before we do any of that, we're going to, as Peach, hop over here, and then just land next to you guys and heal everybody. This is fantastic. And the Smasher is out and about too. I actually didn't notice that. Um, so now Mario. Yep, 
you're Mario. You're going to damage boost everyone. Then, you're gonna smack him, and that's gonna be one. Oh, a critical, 118 damage. This isn't gonna be super crazy, but it does 83 damage. And then finally, you can hit him as well, and that's gonna do a critical 109 damage. Right there, we just hit him for more than half of his health. And I don't think we can do anything else, so I think it's time to end the turn. Okay, the Smashers are gonna be on the move, but I think we could handle this. He might actually hit all, all three of us at once. But once again, Rabbit Peach, I'm, not, I'm seriously gonna end up making that mistake. Peach is just gonna hop up and down and heal all of them. That is so good. It's not a huge amount of healing, but a little bit of healing every turn is good, better than like a, a medium amount of healing every like four turns that Rabbit Peach had. So we can land you here and really doesn't matter. The only problem now is that we don't have a damage boost, but I think even then, if we give you this, we can throw the grenade at you, right? It won't hit any of our teammates. What will do more damage? This will actually do more damage. So let's go ahead and do this. Oh, boom, 97 damage. He's down to 93, which is like, I wish we could slide tackle him, but we could hammer slam him, not hit a single one of our teammates. We might win right here, we did! That might be our easiest boss fight yet, and I think it's because Peach is super awesome. Wow, what a team we got. Is he done? He's like, I'm sick of this, I'm out of here. No, he's not done, I was gonna say. I was gonna say, like, it just sort of seems weird if it would be that easy. Okay, then what do we wanna do about this? Once again, uh, Peach could, I wanna get them all to safer spots though, if we can manage. Cause we don't have attack. Okay, so that's sort of the thing, right? Is that that wasn't the end of the turn. Everybody can still move, everybody has their movement. That's actually pretty crazy. Um, We will get you here. I mean, maybe that was silly, but what I could do is get, oh no, wait, Peach did move. Okay, never mind. Um. Well then maybe I could do this to get started on beating this dude up. And then like, I don't know how I wanna do that. I guess just land here and that way like he maybe won't be able to decide as much where he wants to go. I can't wait to upgrade Rabbit Peach, that's gonna be fun. Okay, so this isn't gonna hit Mario, that's great, but it actually might freeze this dude. It does. Now he's not gonna be able to do too much more than that, but that's still fantastic. He's gonna get smacked, but I can shield. Once again, I don't know if this is gonna do all that much. Enemies, he's gonna blast Mario. Sort of forgot about that dude already. See, now he's doing more damage than ever, but a critical is only 35, that's not much. I'm guessing he just must be that he has a ton of phases. This is his third phase now. I mean, just like the, the Rabbit Kong. Rabbit Kong had three phases. So that might just be what it is. Oh, okay, that's actually really dangerous. Okay, so she's gonna get hit, poor Peach. Poor Peach indeed. I'm glad though, she kicks butt. That is so cool. Okay, now what? Uh, oh, there's a supporter over there, okay. So all we need to do now is not do that one because that's actually gonna explode and hurt people. We don't want that, so boom, do that. Oh, we didn't make her jump off of anybody. That might have been a big mistake. Uh, Yeah, I don't know what I wanna do about that now. Mario can move. Oh, you. Oh, you. Eesh. All right, Mario. Can you move? Can Mario move? Yeah, you can move. All right, let's try to get him hidden somewhere safe, right? I mean, can Peach, from here, block these guys? No, actually she can't hit either of them, so I've made some major mistakes this round. Then maybe the best thing I could do is, both both of these angles I have 100% shot, so I'll take it. Where's the supporter at, though? The supporter's over there, so I can't quite hit him here. Might as well just hit you. So things aren't looking good on this third phase, but we're getting there. And then I don't want you to do this because you're, yeah, I mean, you can't hit anybody. So there's that one done. That was not a good round. First two rounds were fantastic. This one, not so much. Eesh. Okay. Well, you're going to move over there. And you're going to move over here. And the supporters are starting to make things look scary. I hope the supporters can't heal the bosses, but they probably can. You're gonna lob a grenade. Oh, please don't be too much damage. 35. Oh no, I think Rabbit Mario actually might get taken out here. And things were going so good though. 
because this other supporter hasn't moved yet. Okay, he's moving over here. Please don't hit Rabbit Mario. You're gonna hit Rabbit Mario, no! Oh, 32, okay, we're still kicking, we're still kicking. You're gonna run over here and, and just like, I guess just like get away as far as possible, right? I mean, I don't really know where you could go. Where does this pipe lead? In a big circle. <laughs> so maybe it'd actually be safer go this way. If I did this, it actually wouldn't be too big of a deal just to hit you as I go along and then just get you over here, I guess. I just need him safe somewhere but as close to Peach as possible, because Peach actually doesn't have too much movement. So that's a, a little weird. All right, so where's the best place I can land where I'm healing? I guess I can only heal him. It's something, though. Ready? Boom. Okay, so that gets some heals out. We can do some damage reduction for everybody, which is fantastic. So now, Mario, you can't do a ton in your position. I can't side attack this dude though, which is actually a shame. Um, Man, we are actually starting to get really into bad positions here. Maybe this is what we get for not managing these guys right away and focusing more on, uh, you know, other things. I don't really know. I could maybe even make Mario just land right back here. Like maybe that's the best thing I could possibly do. Like just get a free slide attack in, go through the pipe, this is Peach is out in the open right now, which I don't like. But really, what more can I do? We'll get this down. And then just blast this dude again. I mean, even if we have to just slowly blast him down, that will technically work. All right, let's end the turn. This is starting to get really nasty. Ooh, who's gonna hit who? Yikes, and it hit both of them. I need to spread people out then. Like, it's just so hard because I'm trying to get Peach to heal them. So this is the downside of Peach's heal. No, I don't want you moving closer, though. I was hoping you'd use that on the boss. Okay, well, you didn't. And now he, the boss has that move now, too, which stinks. Come on, don't don't hit Rabbit Mario. Yep, there goes Rabbit Mario. That is the worst. So this is what, what happens when we don't manage everything correctly. Man, I really don't like supporters. They are not fun to go against. Because, like, I wanted to heal. I mean, I can still heal, but the problem is now I'm gonna get blasted as I do that. I almost maybe want Mario to start moving then. <sighs> I don't know what I wanna do about this. There's just not much coverage either, and that really stinks. Like, I just might have to have you here. I think it's your best bet. You're gonna get hit, but is it gonna do 79 damage? It's gonna do 35. Let's up play. Okay, Mario, let's up play indeed. Let's make you jump off of that, land like that, and then I don't even know, I guess just hammer you. Like that'd probably be the best thing we could do. Nice. And then let's hammer blast you if we can. I mean, we could just, we could finish him off normally with a normal blast, right? Okay, I'm doing the wrong thing here. Yeah, we could. Okay, let's save it for uh, the boss then if we can. And then, I, I, we might lose this though. Like that's sort of the thing. There is still plenty of opportunity to lose this right now. Let's throw a grenade. And maybe this might even hit the boss as well. That'd be great. It didn't. Why didn't that work? Okay, maybe I should have thrown it towards the boss and maybe that would have worked out better. Oh, poor Peach. She didn't get hit there, but she might get hit soon enough. Oh no. Yeah, you're gonna lob a grenade. That might do enough to take her out, depending on what it is, 27. So I actually didn't hit her. Well, it hit her a little, bit, a little bit, but not a huge ton. So where can we bring Yoon? I mean, this is a bit dangerous, especially if I need the heals really bad. Oh, I don't know, oh, I don't know. I don't know. <laughs> I don't like how I don't know. So it's gonna learn. It's gonna take me some learning to figure out how to properly use Princess Peach, I think. Not only that, but I think uh, Mario probably had his damage boost this turn, so I just wasted a good opportunity again. So, I don't know. Like I could just have Mario walk right up since he has so much gosh darn health right now. But would that be a good idea? You know, like that's sort of the, the thing. Cause I could have Mario just walk up, slide attack you and, and then just wait right here and blast this guy and then we can worry mail, maybe next turn, um, just hammering on the boss. So don't worry about you just yet. This isn't gonna take you out though. This well, so maybe I just gotta do this. My, uh, my cover's gonna be blown. Oh no, it won't. Okay, cool. So this is actually like the first two ways were so easy. 
This third wave is insane. It looks like a lot of it seems to be like, you know, I could take these pipes and sneak up behind. All right, I know, you're mad. You're gonna get closer, but not really all that much closer. So, where can Mario go here? That might be good. I want him close enough so that he can do the hammer, and then she can just go right there and heal. Okay, so we'll do just that. I mean, I might run up here with Mario. Oh, I keep forgetting you have that. Luckily, it didn't freeze me this time. How big is that? So not big enough. Well, I don't have the hammer. Oh, I'm the worst, I am the worst at this game. Okay, I'm gonna heal you as much as I possibly can. Let's do a bit of that. I could have done so much better if I realized I didn't have the hammer. Okay, now the problem is is that Mario is probably gonna get hurt no matter what here. So we might as well just damage boost everybody and just really hit him good. Cause this will, this is all the damage I can do with Mario. Boom, critical, 118, that's beautiful. 108, 70, okay, so we just gotta do this. I know it's gonna hit Mario, but it did also hit him. Okay, enemy's turn, the Smashers move her closer and closer, that almost took out Princess Peach. But it's just us and the Smasher who's actually gonna take the pipe. I hate that Smashers are smart. I really don't like it, oh gosh. So he actually wasn't able to hit a Saren. Oh my gosh, that was too close. So I could either do that, or I could slide attack him and go somewhere, or I could bounce off of him. I could bounce off of Princess Peach. I could go like that, but I don't like that as much. I think we need to make as much distance from him as possible, really. So let's just go here. And hopefully Princess Peach can walk that far. If not, I'm gonna be feeling real stupid right now. Okay, she can, thank goodness. And then if I land him here, or land her here, we can do that. How low is the boss? I really hope he's low. I really, really hope he's low. Um, Cause we're definitely gonna do this and hope that that is actually given to the boss. We're gonna lob this thing. Oh, we could take him out right here. We could. So we're actually gonna win, but we're not gonna win with a perfect. I definitely made some mistakes, but we won. And unless this isn't his last phase, but I'm pretty sure it is, cause he's reeling and he ain't doing much dealing. Uh. Weird lack of sound effects. Um, what? So we're not done. Well then my best bet, cause Peach already has her set up, is to set up Mario's, that way, if this guy does come on, he's gonna come over here regardless. Might as well honey him, that's a lucky shot. So what can we really do here? How far can, Peach can go that far. So Mario can also go that far. Hmm. I don't know what the better move is then. I guess we'll just get Mario here and then hope that Peach can land that far. Boom. Right on top of it or something. I don't know what we're supposed to do with this thing. Are we supposed to pick it up? Are we supposed to throw it? We've never had something like this before. Or it's just a big purple arrow. Because we can't attack this thing. All right, let's damage reduction whoever we can if that's just us. It's, oh, we can't just do it on ourselves. Okay. Well, I'll do this. Maybe hit him. I hit him a little bit. How low is he now? Low enough for Mario to take him out. Boom, get out of here, punk. So what do we do with this thing? I don't really know. I hope it doesn't pop back into its place though, cause that would be stinky. It might just, it might just, he looks like he's getting ready to do that. What can I do with it? Um, okay, boom. Okay, was that it? I think we did it. <laughs> that was a weird ending to the boss fight, but we beat him. <laughs> to be or not to be, ice is the question. I, I don't, that's a weird pun. There you go, it's yours. It's yours, punt it! <laughs> Princess Peach is awesome. See ya. Hi, Rabbit Peach. Meet Princess Peach again. We are honored to have you join us, your royal highness. May I suggest we return to your castle so we may prepare for our next match? That'd be peachy. <laughs> you gotta get the pun in there. So there we go, we win. Well, sort of, we did fair. So we didn't even do it in the recommended amount of turns either. We really had to drag that out. That's my worst score for anything yet. Ugh, I don't like myself right now. Um, so we get a bronze trophy, which is 
him chasing his own clothes, which is really weird. Peach, she's kind, she's determined, she's ready to fight. Hail to the princess, customize her regally by accessing her skill train. Awesome. Team rank up, your hero's health has increased. Woohoo! That's gonna be good for replaying this world, which we're gonna be doing for the rest of today's episode. New weapons in stock. There are new weapons available to purchase at the Battle HQ. Sherbet Desert Challengers. Explore Sherbet Desert from scratch and find all 10 rabid challengers. Complete challenges to gain more power orbs. Lift, you've uh, learned to lift. With this contextual action, you can upheave heavy rabid statues you encounter along the way. Kum, that's also something we'll do today. And here we are, back at the Mushroom Kingdom. So we're a, bit, a little battered, a little bruised. So we're gonna go to the Battle HQ first. Actually, can I go in the castle? I haven't really looked at that yet, I doubt it. I don't know why, I just have a feeling I should doubt it. Um, yeah, we can't go in. That's sort of a shame. Hopefully we can go in by the end of the game. That'd be really cool. But now we have Princess Peach on our side, which is so awesome for so many reasons. And she's a really good character too, which probably means we need to do a lot of skill tree upgrades for her. First off, let's take a look at her weapon selection. Um, We have 2,492 coins and Mario does have some new stuff. So Mario always has to be in our team, which is a weird thing. So we might as well get him as good of a weapon as we can at any point. So if we could get the honey, that's gonna be 95 to 105. So this is already gonna make the stuff we're already doing easier. Hmm. Okay, we'll buy this as well. I know we're buying a lot for Mario, but he's the character we always have to have out at any given point in time. So it's always good to do that. Um, now here's Peach. If we go back to her primary. She needs a thousand coins for a better weapon. She has her base right here that's 90 to 100. These are actually 140 to 150, okay. And then her skill tree, she should have, oh. That's weird. She only has 25 points. Because with Rabbit Mario, when we first got him, it gave us like 150 points to spend. Just to, you know, get him all caught up, but not the same for Princess Peach? That's weird. All right then, so we should probably increase something. Stomp range. Stomp damage is what I want. We have 70, so yeah, let's do that. 100 damage is insane. I actually really want that. Okay, good. Um, Then, Let's go ahead and, no, keep going, keep going. I don't know how much I'm gonna be playing Rabbit Peach now, but it might be good to pick up some stuff. Uh, and health range, we could increase the health range. Weapon parry, heal, mega heal, we can improve, yeah, let's improve the mega heal. There you go, just in case we do use her. Okay, we've been needing to upgrade Rabbit Luigi for so long that he has over 200 of this stuff. So, um, let's give him an extra dash. We can only have out the tune. Um, let's make his dash really strong. And then let's also get this stuff. Well, he has a area attack affecting all enemies within a range. It's a rocket. Interesting, maybe we should play some Rabbit Luigi, Peach, and Mario. That might be an interesting combo. Here we have Weaken, weakens enemies near Rabbit. Actually, that sounds really good. Okay. How much, we have 95 points left, so we can like maybe increase his health. That might be good. Um, we'll get one of these, these are always nice to have. Uh, let's see, weapon parry, barrier cooldown, weaken range. Let's increase to weaken a little bit, and what what might cost 15? Let's, let's just make sure we can use as much as we can possibly use right now. Um, this costs, you know, only 10, but it's not really a valuable thing. We could do that. Let's do this one, because that's helpful. At least have one character with that. Luigi has some stuff as well, 55 points. What could we put that at? Dash damage. We might want to do his dash damage. Um, Cause he has his itchy feet, but it would be good to have more steely damage, but I think that we should go ahead and do the uh, extra dash damage then. And then what we'll cost did 10 points then? This, that's not that big of a deal then. Okay, we're good. And then Rabbit Mario, we're definitely gonna be using him at some point. So, what should we do? Maybe we should wait until he has another dash, because having three of those would be big. That's why we were waiting for originally anyways. So Peach, once again, I'm surprised she doesn't have too much. I mean, I guess she has some skills. Oh, they just activated them already to be prepared for this boss fight. So what could we really do here? Increases the range of team jump, increases, um, our heroes can, okay. Healing jump, okay, that increases the healing jump. Increase the seal jumps range of effectiveness. I really want this. We should probably save for that then. Okay, we'll save for that. That's as much as we can do for right now. I think we'll try the team of Mario, Rabbit Luigi, and Peach. See how that works out. So can I do that right now actually? 
I can't. So I'll go do that once we run into a battle again. But yeah, honestly, it wasn't as hard going through World 2 as it was World 1, I think. I mean, overall, but I, I, I feel like I've been getting better at the game. So our main focus right now is that now that we know how to do some of the things, I mean, actually, maybe I shouldn't. I was gonna say maybe we should go through World 2 again and try to get any kind of collectibles we can get, but the problem is that there are still some collectibles we cannot get because there's other th abilities we don't have unlocked. Like there's some kind of block that we're supposed to be able to smash down that we just don't have the ability to do that. So we'd have to go through World 2 to get all the customizations twice, and that seems like a pain. So instead, maybe we'll just focus today going through the washing machine and just mastering everything, everything we weren't able to do. Because there are nine, there's eight in a boss fight, and then there's an extra thing. Well, this is Ancient Gardens. I don't know what this extra thing is then. Um, Let's go to Sherbert Desert, same thing here. Huh, I don't know how you get there. I, I never noticed that before. Anyways, same thing here, right? It's eight in a boss fight. Okay, so we have, which one? The fourth one, and this one was just one level. So we might as well give this a shot, see how it works out. Hopefully it ain't too bad. Yep, we're good. So I will have to change my team composition, but that's fine. A lot of you said you didn't mind me going through and perfecting everything. A lot of you just said you wanted me to show off the challenges. So I think that maybe, since we were starting to struggle towards the later half of this, and we need to improve the characters we have a lot, especially Princess Peach. Sorry, I had the mid-sentence urge to have a tea. <laughs> A sip of team. But um, since we have Princess Speech, I think next episode we'll do World 1's challenges, and then episode after that we'll do World 2's challenges. You guys are letting me know there's only four worlds in the game, which I was actually surprised by. I thought there was gonna be at least like five or six. But hey, four is fine. The, the, the worlds are plenty long. So once again, go back to Battle HQ, and we're gonna go Mario, Rabbit Luigi, Princess Speech. Because we haven't been playing too much Rabbit Luigi. Some of you guys have been asking for it, so I'm glad to give it. So let's go ahead and... Get started. This is the only battle we need to do and we need to escort Toad. And we are more powerful than we've ever been before. So I hope we can handle this just fine. I mean, I might be a little bad with Rabbit Luigi. I haven't played him in a while. But hey, maybe this will be a great team combo. What can we do here then? I could get Mario over here, but maybe it's not the best first option. Like if I, if I had, wait. Uh, Mario, still can't land on you. Hmm, how do I wanna do this then? Because if I had Rabbit Luigi maybe closer to like here, maybe that'd work. And that's 100% chance of landing actually, cool. We'll try that. And then Mario, I want you over here and try to land on this guy. There we go, so that's gonna do 100 damage. This is gonna instantly take him out too. That's beautiful stuff. And then we'll probably have him Steal his spot a bit. Just like that, boom, instant takedown. So there's one Ziggy down. Now if we take a look at what else is around here before we continue on with anything else, we have, uh, what, what is that? That is a supporter, a supporter, and a Ziggy. Okay, because you know what we could do? Well, no, didn't you say this was 100% chance shot earlier? Weird. We could do this some. It won't do too much here, but. But we also have enemies in range, minus 30% weapon damage. We can weaken them, immunity to super effects. We'll get this barrier set up, I think. And then, I mean, I could just try to hit some of these guys. Like if I have a 50% chance, might as well take that chance, boom. And then Peach over here, and she can't do a huge ton, but she can get over here, and and then blast this dude, and that might be good. Yeah, that could be good. And now she has a grenade. I've been talking about how badly I wanted, a, you know, like a grenade. I was expecting Yoshi to have the grenade type weapon, but no. All right, so this isn't gonna hit any of our teammates. So we can just go ahead and blast this dude. Goodbye, Ziggy. And then we'll get this prepared. That way, you know, if anybody comes for us, hopefully we can uh, handle it. Now I don't want. I don't want Toad to go out too far just yet, even though we have more heals than we ever have had before, because I don't want them to throw grenades at him. I think from here it's gonna be fine. Like Mario might take some damage, as you can see, but Peach can do this kind of stuff. You ready for this? Blast him. Oh, that didn't do too much. So her move is good, but it's not as good because while that is, of course, you know, hitting him, it's not hitting him for too much. The only thing, like, I, I still really enjoy playing Rabbit Mario, and I think that, to be honest with you, I will enjoy it more once we're playing with, like, say, uh, 
Rabid Mario in this combo instead of like Rabid Luigi, personally. So we could hop over to here and heal Mario. Yeah, heal Mario. Might be what's best. Ra la la! Because Mario took a good beat in there. And then Mario. Well, first off, we could play as Peach here and, and like toss this grenade to one of them or the other. We'll do this one. Okay. And now. I can't do too much more than maybe like hide here. But that's fine. Because I can make that work. And then I'm gonna make it so that these guys get weakened. So that way, if we're somehow unable to defeat all of them here, they're weaker. Um, I don't know if I'll use that just yet. In the meantime, I'll get Toad here. We gotta start moving him sooner or later. So all of our heroes are pretty strong right now. Oh man, I didn't think I'd have that little movement from here. That's actually sort of bumming me on. And I can't reach it from there either. Oh, that stinks. Really? I can't hit, like, so basically my best bet is just to dash you like that. Land, I don't know, anywhere really. And I guess hit you with the hammer, right? I mean, maybe then before I even do that, because Peach hasn't attacked, right? No, Peach has attacked. Okay, then never mind. Um, Get you like this. This I was gonna see maybe I could power up and uh, power up Peach and then she could lob her grenade, but I already used her attack, so I can't. That's okay. Now I'm definitely gonna activate this. And then I could just, I could use the hammer, but I don't need to because this is gonna one hit KO you. So might as well do that. And then it's just Rabbit Luigi here. Who can't do all that much. I mean, I could do this. Would this hurt me as well? It doesn't seem to. <laughs> now he's out in the open too, so that's pretty good. Uh, it's not really worth doing that, so hopefully, if this guy moves, Mario will smack him, just like that. And hopefully it might even be a critical. It is a critical, so it wasn't taking him out. Oh, but you're still gonna throw your grenade over to Peach. Actually, honestly, I'd rather you throw it to Peach because she always gets a guaranteed, guaranteed, yeah, guaranteed heal off of the jump. So there are now new characters starting to get ready to move. I might as well get Toad like Kieran. But we're destroying more than we're getting destroyed, so that's the most important thing. Because I can now get you like over here. Yep, and that's gonna get rid of that guy. I'll try to get Rabbit Luigi a little bit farther ahead then. Rabbit Luigi has a decent amount of health. He's only one point of health less than Mario. Maybe I'll just have him around here then. That way, that everybody's getting healed from Peach, or at least everybody who needs to get a heal is getting healed, right? Yes, because we did improve the range of it, so we can now land here and get some good stuff going on. And there's no enemies to attack right now. There's literally no enemies about. Next turn, or the turn we're about to do, there will be. But in the meantime, there's nobody. So I did want to say thank you guys so much for your support on this series. Uh, I know that like I was looking at the analytics for the series for the first time, and a lot of you are watching through the entire episode, which is cool because these episodes are super duper long. So thank you so much for doing that. I really appreciate it for sure. I think I might even want to get like Peach out here. That way when this dude comes up, I can blast him in the face, but the problem is he's probably gonna, maybe that's not a good idea just yet. Like maybe I do just want to, Move Toad somewhere, like just further along. Because the problem is, he could, this guy right here could hop out of this pipe and just come out of here, or hop out of the ground and come out of there. So maybe I just don't want to move Toad this turn. Like I know it's gonna make things take even longer than they already are, but what more can I do? I'll get Mario set up there. It's not the most coverage, but get you there. And then Peach will have her thing next turn. I just really hope this isn't a smasher that immediately notices us and smashes us, but it might be. Let's find out. Let's wait here and... So it's actually just a uh, Ziggy. So all my worries were basically for not. You're gonna slot attack her, that's no big deal. There is a smasher out that way, but I couldn't really care less about that right now. <laughs> You're gonna dance around, huh? Okay, so here comes that smasher. Ever so pleasant. And there, there's gonna be somebody there. Okay, so Toad, could you go through this? You still can't go through this fight. Maybe I should've moved him a little bit. That might've been a mistake, an oversight by me. Because if I were to uh, get you through here, could you, you can't do too much. Hmm. 
then maybe I should get Rabbit Luigi Thrun, and he can go a little bit farther. Hmm. Where is Peach at right now? Oh, she's just on the other side of that block. Okay, <laughs> nothing crazy, nothing crazy. Okay, lots to do. Oh, I still can't make that, I'm the worst. Okay, you know what? You're gonna get as close as you can to Toad. Cause that way somebody's at least in the area of protecting Toad. Okay, you can't quite attack her, or him, or it, but you can, so why don't you? I mean, I really could just set up like that and then toss a grenade over there. Like maybe that's my best, but oh, you have that, really, dude? Really, that's the game you're playing right now? Whoa! All right, just toss a grenade over there. I mean, I could blast you now, and it's gonna be zero percent chance. All right, well then, I'll throw the ducky grenade over there, and hopefully this will be ready for later too. Nice. And that's about the extent of what I can do here. Like, I could do this, but I don't know if it's a good idea. I mean, it might be. Let's give it a try. <laughs> oh boy. Now, Rabbit Luigi can't do too much. I mean, like, who would he bazooka? Yeah, there's just nobody around. And then Mario can't do too much, so that's all we're doing this turn. It's, oh, okay, it's just gonna be a hopper. Hoppers aren't too scary. Because we were really close to doing this one. We just had, like, Rabbit Mario or something. Not even Rabbit Mario. It was like Luigi got taken out at the last second. This is what I was sort of hoping for, though. Is that it would be something that where she could blast and get a benefit from it. I wish that he didn't have the shield up, but it's definitely better than nothing. Okay, he's gonna hit Mario. That's not the end of the world. This guy's getting closer and I don't like it because we're not really in a good formation to handle it. Like maybe I should have tried this with the formation I originally had because even that formation would be stronger now technically. All right, well, I'll do what I can with what I got, which would probably be this. Boom. Whoa, vampire, I forgot I had that, so extra health for Rabbit Luigi. That's awesome. Oh wow, this isn't gonna take you out, seriously? Wow, this is a very weak move. Um, well then I think that I just wanna zap your weapon damage. I mean, what I really could do is as Peach, I could go through here and slide attack you to do some decent damage to you. And I can't hop, hop off a of Rabbit Luigi though. Has Rabbit Luigi moved? Rabbit Luigi has moved. Come on, Rabbit Luigi. Just blast you. Oh, it was a critical though. So that's gonna shake things up a little bit and that's gonna do more healing for us. So maybe now I can change things up. Can She still can't just like walk up there and get him though. And she still won't be able to from here. Can I just hit him? I can. Let's just hit him. That's fine. And then she hasn't moved yet, so I can get something done with that, which might just be uh, going over like here. Cause she has so much health, it's crazy. Like she, it's, it's so crazy that she's the tankiest character we have right now. I don't know why, I just wasn't expecting it. I don't know if that'll reach the range for defending. Because here's the thing, I could get Mario up here, not only blast that dude, but also, he won't be able to get up here. So Peach, can you, she can at least protect Mario. I don't think it's really gonna change too much, but it will protect her, too. So really, I just wanna damage boost, and then, uh, oh, I can't do that other move though, so I didn't really think about that. But maybe we can critical you. No. Didn't happen. That's fine, that's fine. Cause he's gonna, yeah, he's gonna try to do something about it, but not really be able to do too much. So there's gonna be another Smasher that hops out of here. I do remember most of it. But luckily, I feel like we perfected more this turn than we, I mean, this world than we did last world. So this section, you know, of the series where we're, you know, re-going through some things, wouldn't it be, it won't be too bad. But now I can, uh... oh, I cannot, actually. Um, Why can I not hop off of her? That is odd to me. I can't hop off of Princess Peach right now. Uh, I honestly have no clue why. So I'll just focus on something else. Like blasting this dude. Um, I actually might get Rabbit Luigi through here and, and have him, actually, I don't think he could do enough damage to finish him off. Ain't that awkward. All right, Rabbit Luigi, make your way up here. Okay, so if we wanna play more Rabbit Luigi, we can, but we need to upgrade his weapon desperately. Cause like that won't do enough. But I mean, I could just blast him, Princess Peach could slide tackle him, and then Princess Peach can do more productive things with her uh, things. 
Oh, I can't jump off Rabbit Luigi though. I was sort of hoping that I was going to be able to. But that still won't finish this dude off. How ridiculous is that? All right, we might as well do this then. Boom. Because that definitely will finish him off. And then get the hero sight. Toad can move forward. He can move forward to here, and so far as he can move as well. So he has such limited range of movement. I don't appreciate it. We'll, we'll just block you from super effects. I don't really know if it'll do you too much of a benefit, but we're sure as I could have tried. Well, at the least, where's Mario? Will this increase? It will increase the range at least a little bit, but not in the direction I really wanted her to go. I wanted her to go this way. So I guess we'll just do this. Is there really anybody we can reach from here? Guess not. Which means also they definitely aren't reaching us because there's this one smasher and then there's another one popping up. There's definitely gonna be a smasher. I know it's in my heart of hearts. So maybe what we could do. I don't really know. Can you reach him from here, dude? You can. Okay, that could work. Let's bazooka you then. Let's see how much damage this does. Catch! Not too much. Really, he has some super underpowered weapons for what we want to accomplish right now. But we could have him slide tackle him. But before we do that, uh, Mario, can you make your way over there? Jump off of him? You can't. Of course you can't. That'd be too convenient. <laughs> okay. Um, let's just get you like here then. I mean, I could actually just move you one space, and then you can. Okay. And it's a vampire move. I really like his slide tackle. That's a really good setup we have there. So I think Rabbit Luigi has some potential for sure. Uh, let's get you here and land off of you. And that right there is almost enough to finish him off. Um, and then we'll get him set up to take care of the next smasher that's inevitably gonna show up. So now, I could blast you. I could just play as Princess Peach, not quite reach over there. Hmm. As long as there's nobody spawning behind us, which right now there is not, that's a big thing. So maybe we'll just get Peach up here and just blast him, finish him off, just like that. And that's really all we can do in this turn besides um, moving Toad. Like that's our really our last major thing. So we'll get a few free coins out of it and then move him here. It's such a, a slog. It is just like moving inch by inch. So there we go. I mean, I hope we don't miss out on the turn requirement. I actually don't know what that is. Cause that could actually be a danger at this point is that I miss out on the turn requirement. Cause Toad is so very close. Everybody is in good heals. So as long as Toad doesn't get too beat up, we'll be fine. So I think I honestly will get Toad here. Mario doesn't have his move, but Peach has hers. So I think I will get this ready. And then I will um have Mario like slide tackle him Come back. Gotcha. gotcha. Um, so what's gonna do more damage? This is gonna do, oh, this is gonna do so much more damage. So we'll do this, then Peach can hit him. Let's see, cause yeah, he's definitely gonna smack him right here. I don't know if that's gonna do enough to take him out. Probably not. Oh geez, is that too close? It's almost too, no, it is too close. Oh, come on. So of course you get the lucky crit worst time possible because that's how the scheme treats me. It loves me a lot. Uh, we might as well do this. Boom, blast you. Please land a critical in revenge. It's a revenge crit, that's good. I'm just glad that Toad didn't fall down the pit. That would've been the worst. Where's Toad right now? Toad is over here and we've already moved Toad. You're kidding me, right? Fine, we're gonna move right. If we if we do this and we aren't, like, like if I run out of turns and I don't get a perfect, I'm gonna be so mad at this game. We're just gonna land you as far as we can while still healing Toad. Cause we just need Toad to move. We just need him to keep moving his little Toad legs. Cause at this point it's getting frustrating. All right, so another smasher. At this point we could probably ignore this dude for a little bit. Oh, well he's moving actually. Once again, there's a, you know, this is a bottleneck here that we need to make sure that, you know, he's not in the way. So I think at this point I might want to move Mario like uh, maybe I should move Rabbit Luigi first? Yes, Rabbit Luigi is definitely who I want to move first. That way Mario can come over here and, and bounce off of him, pick up these two coins, and then land some more gun. Cause that's just 100 damage, it's like you have to you know, take that opportunity. 
And then I'll just have you land here. That's fine. Boom. And then Toad's already moved, right? Yeah, Toad's already moved. So Peach can't get too far along. But she can go here. Just in case something does go really bad, she could actually activate her damage reduction. But I don't know if she really needs it. Hmm. It might be worth doing, just in case. And then we'll... Hmm. We'll do this first. And then he's gonna move closer. Hopefully not close enough to do attack. He, he probably will. Yep. I really don't like going against Smashers. It seems like when they're like this, their health is connected. So like if it hits one of them, it hits all three. That wouldn't do enough to finish you off. This would land on you and finish you off, but it also hurt our teammates. So we might as well damage boost and just use Rabbit Luigi. That's the worst, but hey, it's what we got. Really? Are you kidding me? That's so bogus. That is so bogus. I can't wait to get this weapon out of here. I don't like the burn effect. It's I don't like unpredictable ones that really you will never know if it will actually help you or not or until it's way too late and you're just done for. So like fire, bouncing, don't like those ones. It seems like honey is always the way to go. At that and rock. Rock is super good. And they both essentially do the same thing. Ain't that funny. Okay, so the first thing I need to do is probably get Mario over here and, okay. Maybe have Rabbit Luigi go like it, this. And then, why I wanna do that is so that Mario can get over here and, you know what? Attack you, get you closer. Then, we're gonna weaken you, just like that. We're gonna have Mario come on over and land like right here and, and do that. Then, and this is all just distracting them while Toad moves. I'm gonna go ahead and have Princess Peach come over here, jump like that, land like, oh. uh, here. And then I really hope that Mario can land his hammer without hurting them. He can, but he doesn't even need it. Oh, that's actually, I'm looking at the wrong character then. Yeah, we could just blast you and be done with it. Boom. And that's good. None of our other characters can move right now, so we should finish with that. Cause this guy's gonna pop up, but he can't really do anything this turn. And they just have Toad move. Come on, Toad, move it, move it. Move that little Toad butt. Where are you, over here? and Just get you there. And I re we're gonna run out of turns. We have to be running out of turns here. And, um, who, who do we have and what are our options? Hmm. I could slide attack and do the healing move again. I think that might be what's best. So we could land right here, because all three of us need healings. So that's good. And that's not quite what I want, but I could throw the grenade and actually does more damage for right now. So what we could do is get this ready, and then move to her and Throw this grenade and then blast him and maybe somewhere we can hit a critical. Boom, that's gonna do 74. Then Mario's gonna blast him in the face. Boom. Yes, we did critical him. Get out of here, you punk. And then we can just slide attack him and be done with it. That is perfect, that is perfect. Then we can just end this turn. And we get some vampire health for that. So Rabbit Luigi is really good at self-sustain because he can just get the vampire health. Okay. Um. That's a little scary, but at the same time, is can Toad just finish now? Yes, he can. Okay, so we won, but did we do it in the right amount of turns we're about to find out? Yes, perfect, perfect, 13 out of 13. That's all I wanted to see. Thank goodness, thank goodness. But yeah, make sure you guys let me know in the comment section if you wanna see, um, what's it called? If you would like to see me do the challenge levels uh, next episode, starting with World 1. Or if that's something you want me to push off until later, you'd rather me just finish on continuing through the main story, I'd love to hear it. Okay, so we've done that one. Now we just have to do this and that. Oh, it's still gonna take me a little while, but let's get it done. Okay, so before we get started with this battle, of course, let's go to our weapon selection. 
Um, so who really needs it? Once again, Luigi, Rabbit Luigi really, really needs it. I feel like I need to change Rabbit Mario them. I think he just hits harder, and now that we're not protecting Toad anymore, maybe it's just a better idea. So let's do that. Um, and he just, you know, there's less I need to upgrade because of that. So I have a thousand coins. Who I should spend that on is probably Peach. Um, cause that'll do much more damage. Even though it is definitely more important to upgrade the primary first, so, well, everything I have, what is the best one? I guess freeze chance is better than burn chance. Um, but it should do, yep, way more damage, which is good. So let's buy this for her, looking good. And that's really all we can do for right now. So skill dream, who are we waiting to have? Um, you were, we're waiting for him to have 80 points, right? So yeah, that's right, we didn't get any more orbs, so don't really wanna expect anything there. Let's go. Right. And all right, let's go. Defeat six enemies, so this is the one we failed on. But the one after this we did no problem. So hopefully we can recreate that in some way, shape, or form. It was basically this team, but Rabid Peach instead of Peach. So we need to all move right now because as it currently stands, the tornado is gonna go straight across. So it's basically gonna act the same way it used to. Which is that good or bad, we'll find out. Now I sort of wish maybe I landed slightly to the right because I think I could have actually just blasted this dude. Um, but what I could do is, obviously that isn't gonna do too much for me, but I could land you here. So we have two sort of shotgun type weapons now instead of one. So what I'm gonna do is probably have, um, let's do Marion first. Let's get this damage boost. And then, you are gonna, ooh, maybe not. Maybe we should do this one first. So if I, how do I wanna do this? Maybe if I like landed around here, this would be good because this is gonna be a place where I can, should be able to lob the grenade maybe without it. Effect, it's still gonna affect the ice blocks, but I think it'll be okay because the way he's gonna move isn't directionally um, better. Unless he's gonna turn around, he's still gonna be able to, he, that's a stupid amount of reach. That is a stupid amount of reach indeed. Okay, well, we can actually finish him off really easy. Okay, let's just do this then, boom. And we already got a smasher out of the way. And it's a golden shot, cool. So, I'll get this set up, I guess. Maybe it's a good idea, maybe it's an awful idea. And then, uh, I can't hit anybody. So we might as well like, get a shield up or something. And then finish things off with that. Tornado's coming in, but it's not even gonna get near any of us, unless it lied. But it did not lie. It cannot tell a lie. Oh wow, I didn't even see him there. Silly him. So now we got the tornado setting up again. It's gonna, just gonna go back right where it came from. So Rabbit Peach is gonna do this, which is totally, I'm just totally fine with it. Oh no, now I'm not. I didn't really expect it to do that. Uh, well, this is gonna hurt. Poor Peach, she's getting really beat up. Oh, and the double attack. I really don't like that. Um, Mario's gonna get hit right away. Same thing again. Okay, so Peach gonna go on healing duty this time. Totally fine with me. So where's Peach at right now? Uh, Peach is over here. She could walk over, slide attack this dude, and then just heal the both of these guys. And that should actually heal them back up to four, at least very close to full. Not so much for Peach herself, but that's okay. Cause now Mario could just walk over here, finish him off, and then stay like about here. And that's really good cause he can actually blast a couple dudes from here. So right now, Mario will have this set up, and then blast him, sure. Maybe critical? Yes, that's good. So that guy's not gonna be too useful for his team. Then where do I want you to land? Cause I could just do it right here. Actually, that'd be very good. Let's do that. Let's do that indeed, cause that could be very, very good. And then, if I do this, it's gonna take out a lot of your health. But if I do this, it's actually gonna do the same amount, it seems, either way. So we might as well, I mean, I could maybe 
move them closer. Hmm. Draws opponents. Will they attack though? Oh, and Mario, activating his shot, is gonna take care of that one, or at least do some decent damage to him. So now they're all super duper close, but not really at a better angle, to be honest with you. So it might be better now to pay, pull up the hammer and finish. Ooh, no matter what, it seems like, unless I land a critical here. Oh, I do land a critical. Nice. Very, very good. So unfortunately, Peach can't do too much here. So she might as well just hang out. Tornado's come, actually, she might be right into the the sight of the tornado. Oh no, Peach, be careful. Okay, she's fine, she's fine. Where's it gonna move this time? It's gonna move straight across. We wanna get everybody out of here, but we only have this guy to deal with now. We are handling this infinitely better. Okay, not a big deal. Oh geez, there's more guys popping up. Cause we have to deal with that guy and then one more. Don't forget about that. Um, Cause this tornado's gonna move across this way. So really, I, maybe Mario could hide like here. I hope that's not a smasher that pops out of there. I'm gonna be sort of disappointed if it is. Uh, Can I land in a way? No, there's no possible way I can land in a way that's gonna heal the both of them. Can Peach heal enemies like this? I actually haven't thought about that. Cause it's sort of like, you know, the, the square lit up where that, you know, that rabbit is. Made me think about it. Hmm. So I can throw this over there, that'd be good. If we could get this guy as close to being taken out as possible, he's now totally revealed as well. So that's good. Might as well protect him. A good man, Rabbit Mario. What if Rabbit, what, what if Peach can't tell the difference between Mario and Rabbit Mario? That'd be funny. Shows you how much uh, Mario really means to Peach. I mean, we'll find out in Mario Odyssey that you might be getting married, which would be crazy. So now there's less barrier zone, which I like. I mean, sort of. It's also hard for us because we can't defend ourselves as much, but we can still get a good amount done. Okay, so that's really all we can do for right now. We need to take care of one more enemy. Whatever that enemy is. A weak one, a strong one, if a Ziggy could just pop up, we could literally just hop on him and defeat him and then be good. It's gonna be two smashers. They're all right next to Mario, the only guy we didn't defend. Oh gosh, oh gosh, this is gonna hurt. Oh no, 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 no. Cause he's gonna get double attack cause this game loves me and we're gonna have to do this again, aren't we? Oh no, okay, thank you. Thank you so much. Oh no, oh that hurt. Yeah, it does actually hurt Peach over there as well. But we're still all okay. I just need to find a way to just destroy this guy. Um, I think the best way then would probably be to get, if I did this, would this hit Mario? It would hit Mario. So I don't really want that to happen, now do I? I mean, what I could do is land like right here and then, nice, get Mario to jump and this right here will just do a starting 100 damage. And that'll be nice. And then how much more health does he have left? 125. Can, I mean, I could get Rabbit Mario to go like this. Maybe this is the best angle for this. I'm not really sure, I guess we'll find out. It will hit Mario a little bit, but that's not the biggest deal in the world. Boom, do that. He's gonna move a little closer. He's definitely gonna hit Rabbit Mario here. Oh, come on. Don't tell me that just took him out. Oh gosh, that's close. And this will take him out and then we'll win. We did it, we did it, it's a miracle. Critical and everything, why couldn't we get a critical earlier? Okay, we did it, perfect. And we also had two turns of spare. So this next one we've already done, we've already perfected. So I don't know if we're expected to perfect it again. I mean, we don't have too much health here. So we might actually wanna reconfigure our team a little bit. Maybe I should switch back to Mario, I mean Rabbit Mar I mean, Rabbit Luigi. <laughs> or maybe we could do Luigi. Could we do that, or do we have to have at least one rabbit? Because I heard that might be a thing, is that you have to have at least one rabbit in your team. That is so bogus. Like that is just that, that sort of funnels the amount of uh, strategy you can have just so that the rabbit part of Rabbit and Mario is in here, which is really short-sighted and sacrifices gameplay, and I don't like that. Well, is there gonna be a mushroom? Here's the thing. There might actually be a mushroom right here. This roster is okay. There is a mushroom right here. All I gotta do is 
Oh yeah, I remember what I had to do here. So we just gotta do it again. And that might be enough at least to help at first. Definitely not gonna be a full heal. But it might be enough to get some good stuff done. I mean, maybe what I should do, because I feel like this combo is working okay, but I mean, we destroyed this as Mario, Rabbit Mario, and Rabbit Peach. So maybe I should heal Rabbit Mario with the mushroom, switch Peach out for Rabbit Peach, and then have Rabbit Peach heal everybody, because we did increase the amount of heals she has, right? So now we can go to our Battle HQ. Team selection, Rabbit Mario, Rabbit Peach, yes. That should be better, I hope. Let's go, I mean, we won this one without too much of a problem. That was last episode, wasn't it? I think so. I can't remember, actually. Maybe it was this episode, I, I, I honestly can't remember. Okay. Prepare for battle, don't even need it. Instead, what we're gonna do is instantly heal everybody for 40% HP. Is that 40% of what they have, or their 40% of their total? It seemed to do good no matter what. So we can slide attack you, and then move like, oh yeah, I remember what we did with her. Well then maybe we don't quite wanna get her up there just yet. Maybe we could just get her back here. And then Mario could, oh yeah, I remember doing that. Oh yeah, I totally remember doing that. And then getting him like here. He has 100% shot just from here. Then let's do that from here. Boom. Boom. And how much else does he even have left at this point? If I move back, obviously this won't do enough to take him out. Hmm. But it might be worth doing. Uh, so we go down here, we could focus on taking out this guy, but I don't think it's worth it just yet. I think it'd be better just to yeah, blast this guy. Just like that. And let's figure this out. Because Rabbit Peach actually hasn't attacked yet. Oh yeah, I remember we did this. Hmm, maybe that was a bit of a mistake. Oh, it doesn't explode just yet. Let's get this set up for sure. And then, this won't hit Rabbit Peach, so we might as well finish you off. Boom. And then, we'll get this out there just because. And I think that's about all the moves we can do for right now. I wish this would work, but I guess it doesn't. Oh, we might as well shoot, see if it happens now. <laughs> okay, so you're gonna walk, you're gonna get exploded, and it's gonna make you mad. You're gonna go through this pipe, and will you, that's a little too far, don't you say? Don't you say it's a bit too far? At least we made some distance with it. Problem now is he might get, she might get beat up. Oh, right in your face, boom. Not a critical down. Oh, she's, he slid attacked him. Okay. We can make this work, though. We can make this work, I think. Um, please. Oh, that's bad. Oh, it ain't good, I can tell you that much. But we just gotta take care of these three, and I think that's gonna do it. But they're both honeyed now, which is really not spectacular. But I can still bounce off of them, right? I can. So what I could do, hmm. Yeah, I wanna slide attack you, bounce off of you, and then maybe just land here in a hammer attack this dude. I think that'll be our best combo. And the best thing we can hope for is something like that. And then, uh, yeah. The power, maybe I should have power boost before I left because that could have actually been really helpful. Wait, is, oh look at that, so Rabbit Mario is not honeyed anymore because, because he hopped off of, Really? Is that how that works? Because if so, interesting. Because I could, here if I, I check, how far is the range of Mario stuff? It goes out to there, that line. So I just gotta keep that in mind. Um, Because I could just, boom. Boom, I think that's close enough. And does that undo the honey? Oh, wait, that's right, because the effect has the, I guess Mario has the unhoneying effect. Hmm. That stinks then. I wish I could have remembered that. This will damage boost him, but he won't be able to hit him. So it's sort of for not. Or can this reach? Yes, it can. Actually, that might be really good. Or it might not be at all. I don't actually know if that changes anything. Can she hit him? 
She can't. She can't hit him. So let's get a, a shield up. Hmm. And then never mind him, smack this dude. Critical, yes, awesome, we get our own critical. Oh, so we're gonna wait for that next turn. I mean, like, he just, it won't do anything, right? I mean, maybe there really is a way to break this shield. But so far, not looking like it. Next turn, he can't move because he's honeyed, which honestly was way scarier than the alternative of getting him honeyed in the Smash or not, because you have a shield. Okay, we just won, I think. I think we just won. Because that Smasher doesn't have too much health. He's running like a coward. A little coward. Because what do you, you have 47 health. I could literally just walk up with you and we could worry about. So Rabbit Peach is still honeyed? Wait, oh yeah, that's right, because she, she got shot again. Hmm, okay. That's okay, I think. If, oh, no, it's not okay. Um, But it's still okay. Because Mario can just do this and win. So we did it, we probably did this too. So after this, we just have to worry about the boss fight, I think. Um, Cause that one, yep, that got that has the win. Boom. And that should be all four characters taken down, which means our battle is cleared. And three out of four turns too. I don't think we did it as well as we did the first time, cause I think we did it in two turns the last time. So definitely not as good, but still pretty decent. Okay, so now we just need to perfect the boss fight, which honestly might be truly, truly challenging, but we get an extra 500 coins, so that's gonna make it slightly easier for us. So now we just have the boss fight, so let's go ahead and deal with that. Yeah. Wow, it's different this time. <laughs> what? The cutscene's different this time, instead of it being Rabbit Mario and Rabbit Peach. Wait, do I not get to choose? Are you not gonna let me choose my characters then? Cause this isn't a good combo. Okay, no, I did sort of let me choose, right? Prepare for battle. But um, last time, you know, it got rid of Rabbit Peach. This time it got rid of a uh, Rabbit Luigi and it gave us a different cutscene. Okay, Mario, I actually don't know. We could do Luigi and then Peach. Oh no, we can't do that. I want to, because it's a good combo. Oh, that's so dumb. Um, Let's just do this then. I think it'll still be good. I mean, maybe, no. Uh, Maybe instead, no, I want to get you out of my team. There you go. Maybe we should just do this. Like, it's a good combo of people, but we'll try this. Um, I have 570 coins. It's not gonna be enough to upgrade anything. I mean, I don't know, I feel like I need to do Peach. I feel like the, the the fact that they gave us Peach this time, it shows that, you know, she's the best character to use for the situation. So let's go ahead and use that. Do I have enough to really do anything more than that? Like with Peach, do I have anything I could upgrade and really be worthwhile right now? Honestly, it does not look like it. Yep, okay. I mean, maybe having, uh, we haven't used too much pipes the last time we used this boss fight, or did this boss fight, so. We'll just fight, and hopefully it'll work out well and we can get everything perfect the first try. Hmm. So, let me move her here. Nobody needs healing just yet, so I can just sort of get everybody in good positions to work with. Because it's just him on the first turn, which is pretty cool. And then we can just lob that over. I mean, I could power boost everybody this turn, that way, you know, everything does do a little bit more. And then let's just have you, no, no, no. I want you to lob this over there and that'll do a good chunk of damage. And maybe it'll even critical, that'd be fun. Come on, you got it. Boom, boom, bounce, 80 damage. Okay, nothing crazy. Okay, so we actually might want you to do this because that'd be nice. Don't know if it's gonna really do too much in this situation, but you never know. We'll get you over here. And and then maybe, just maybe you could land, you can't. Okay, well that's fine. Oh yeah, I remember that happening last time too. Well next turn, next turn. For right now Mario can hide here, and we just need to keep in mind that enemies are gonna start popping up, and when they do we just need to pre be prepared for that. So that's gonna do zero damage. I guess we're not quite at the best angle, so power boosting was actually a huge mistake. Huge mistake indeed. He's gonna go for Princess Peach, he is gonna land it, but it's not gonna be the end of the world. 
All right, let's fast forward this. He's gonna move. Hmm, we can get Mario's thing set up here. Then, oh, where could you move? You can move, I mean, you can move right up to him and just smack him with the hammer. I just, I think we need to conserve our health at least some amount. Like if we were to try to attack him down, wouldn't work out too well. But if I were to go around here, this might even land him in the red. Almost. Why is one? Boom. And then uh, Peach, you could land about here, and that won't heal Mario though, which sort of stinks. Um, can Mario move? Have we moved Mario? We have not moved Mario. How far can Peach run to? Not really all that far. Hmm. Not the best of situations, huh? Definitely we need to improve some things about Peach, but she's pretty good how she is too. We'll do this. I think that she'll probably still be totally vulnerable, but everybody gets a bit of heals, except for Mario's right in the line of fire, so I'm not the smartest person in the world. But I could just get him here. That might be my best bet. All right, uh, Mario, blast him, and then Peach can blast him. Just like that. It won't do too much, but it's something, right? I will do anything. It will do a little bit. Okay. Uh, and this would only protect Peach, so I, I don't think it'll even let us do it. He's low in health already. The first two phases are pretty darn easy, at least from what I've seen. So maybe on that second phase, if there are enemies that are starting to appear, that's when we should start focusing them down. Maybe that's really what we should be worried about. Okay, get all of this. Is Rabbit Mario hurt at all? No, he actually hasn't taken any damage. Only person who has is Peach herself. Okay, well then we can actually just get her a little farther back and then just blast this dude. Again, that should do enough damage. Yeah, it definitely will. So boom, hit you like that. And that'll take care of the first phase. Goodbye to your shield. And our turn, our turn just keeps going. Okay. I actually thought that it would cut scene or something, so I'm feeling a little silly right now. Um, Because this isn't the best situation, actually. Okay, we critical to you, which is great. And then maybe we could just get Mario, like, over here. And then Rabbit Mario. Let's get you... I'd rather have Rabbit Mario get hit in this. I mean, actually, no, Princess Peach has more health. And this won't do a ton, but it's something. It's just a little more damage. Oh, well, that was silly of me. We'll get the bodyguard up, see if it actually does anything for us, and we'll be done with that. Okay, so she he's just gonna straight up smack her, which is just awful, dude. You don't just smack a princess. That's called being a rude dude with a bad attitude. And nobody appreciates that. Oh, are you gonna get two for one here? No, you're not. But you are gonna call up some enemies which personally, I'm not a fan of. So really, what more can I do here besides slide tackling Yoon and then like running as fast as I can over here? I actually think, oh no, he has that. I keep forgetting about that because I'm a dingus face. It'd be cool if we could have hit his teammate as well, but it didn't. Can Peach run out that far? I don't think she can. No, she can't. Okay, so it's not even worth doing. I think then Rabbit Luigi's right here. Can he hammer him? Would that do, yeah, it would do more damage. We might as well. Ready? Ooh, boom, nice, 112. So let's get Rabbit Luigi over here. Um, We'll get Princess Peach, I mean, Princess Peach is the one who needs the heals, right? So we could actually just get her back here and heal herself. I mean, I'm sure Mario could use the heals, but he's not over here now, is he? And then, let's, yeah, definitely throw this. And we just need to be in a good position for next turn. So I can't hit anybody here. Okay, end this turn. Hopefully he won't be able to get close enough because there is a little lip there, so I think that'll make it so uh, a little more difficult. So he's gonna attack Rabbit Mario, which I'm totally fine with. 70 damage is a little harsh, but we can make it work. The Smashers, like, we need to take care of the boss right now and then focus on these Smashers and walk over there and defeat the boss again. The problem is that it's so quickly our cover starts to get blown. So maybe I could get you here. And then, 
Rabbit Marion. Can't use his thing right now, so instead, just blast him like this, boom. And then, get him hidden over here. All right. I could finish him off just like that, and our turn won't be over, right? It won't cut our turn short. I would sure hope not. But hey, we'll find out. He's gonna crawl out. <laughs> I'm just not noticing he does not have feet, does he? Uh, well, I can't see from here. Um, so Peach can move. Oh no, he has feet. Well, not actually, not really. Yeah, he does not have feet. <laughs> that dude is feetless. I mean, I don't have feet either, I have hooves, but at least I have some kind of leg, bottom part of my torso. Uh, I, I can land right back where I was, so I'm gonna do that. Just heal everybody and call it a turn, because we're almost all back up the full. And I could, let's defend ourselves a little bit. 40% damage reduction, but we all take the damage. You know what I can do next turn. Hop, up, and then do the same thing. Okay, so he's mad. He's not a happy guy right now. Smashers are gonna move closer. There are more bunnies popping up as well. Rabbits. You know. So we're gonna have to do something about it. But they're, they are, I mean, I say they're just supporters, but supporters are a huge pain to deal with. I think we need to do what we can as much as we can then. Um, I could check that over to Yoon. Maybe that'll be a good start. I mean, hopefully he doesn't come close enough. Oh, but it did freeze him, so that's good. Oh, don't hit Mario. He's hitting Mario. No, he's not, oh hey, look at that. All right, lands like here. I mean, actually, Mario doesn't need heals. He's at like full. So I even could get her to do that. Cause really, you know what I should do? Slide attack you and make you move like here. Nice. Oh, that hit Mario though. I didn't think about that. All right, that's not, now Mario's not a full. What do you know? Uh, he still has the most health out of everybody, I think. Well, except for Peach. I mean, like, he's the closest to full health out of everybody. Why one? Oh, this will do 100 damage, okay. Boom, take care of that smash. There's one less smasher than what we have to deal with. And then, Peach. Peach over here, I'm gonna have you land like here, and then that actually will not heal him. Okay, well, at least she's healing herself, right? It's better than nothing. And then this smasher over here shouldn't actually be able to land, or shouldn't get close enough. So I think we should just leave that being. So is he actually choosing not to do anything? Oh, but she still has this, doesn't she? I actually didn't realize that. Okay, well, she landed that on Rabbit Mario as well. I should have had that foresight, I guess. Still not that too much, well, not that bad. I actually don't mind that too much. Huh. <sighs> We still have a lot to go though. Like we aren't even close to being done right now. Let's get you like here. Cause that'll do 100 damage. It's a very, very easy 200 damage too. And then uh, Mario could just finish him off. Good. Boom. So the smashers are down. We just had the supporters to deal with, which is still plenty to deal with. Don't get me wrong. Um, Maybe we can just get them here. Cause Peach is already back at the 400 health. That's insane. But let's get her to do that and then do this. It's sort of a shield. I don't know. I actually don't think she's actually protected at all technically here. Yeah, she's not. And there's nobody to hit. End the turn. So next turn we gotta focus on movement. Try to get close to this dude. Oh, let's fast forward this. Cause they're not doing too much either. They're just sort of positioning themselves over and over again. Um. Let's get Mario here. Let's get Rabbit Mario here. Cause who needs heals right now? Rabbit Mario definitely still needs more heals. Actually, he's the only character that really needs heals right now. So I could have Rab I could have Peach land like here. And that should be decent. Heals them up a little bit. When it comes to everything else, let's get Mario ready with this. Because if it does hit anybody, it's not gonna be a smasher, so it's plenty fine. Peach really can't do a ton besides protect Rabbit Mario, which isn't a bad thing to do. And then, I don't know, that was probably a waste. But hey, I haven't used that a ton at all anyways. I don't think it's really coming useful, really, like a single time. 
Okay, so he's mad, so we should not move this turn. But at the same time, you remember how many turns we took last time and we ended up not working out for us too well. So we st we need to start getting over there. So I think if I were to run over there and, well, now could Peach, okay. We are gonna damage boost everybody, just like that. We're going to get Rabbit Mario like Hmm. I guess here. I mean, could he nor no, normally he couldn't walk up there, but he could walk up to here. And he's gonna be damage boosted. Oh, you're gonna get blasted as well. Poor Rabbit Mario can't catch a break right now. Well, this could really hurt. Like, this could really, really hurt a couple rabbits. Oh, yeah. This is gonna land on just about all of them. Boom. And then Peach is way over here. She can't do too much from here. But she she can't walk through the pipe. I didn't really think about that too much. Maybe if I go here, could I land the grenade on the boss from here? Because that'd be really good. I can't. Because I could do this, but with her rabbit Mario as well. Let's do that. And it might even take care of that other rabbit. Boom. It did okay damage, actually didn't do anything incredibly exciting. Oh, I can't, wow, look at this. I didn't think I was gonna get that much distance off of it, but we are indeed going to. Crazy stuff right there. And then, Robin Mario isn't in the best position, but it's good enough. Like, I don't think he's gonna get 100 damage worth of damage received this time. And then we could attack you, but instead, I'm just gonna take you out that way. There's nothing to worry about next turn except for the boss, and that would be really good. All right, enemies, shouldn't be too many. Okay, so she's he's actually just gonna attack Peach, which is plenty fine for me. And then that's his turn done. So this is where we can get some stuff done. What is the best thing to get done? Still, you know, questioning. Like, I would like Peach to come over here and land like that and heal both of these boys if she could, but I mean, almost, almost. Hmm. I mean, maybe I should move Mario back regardless because he can't do his, like, hopping mechanism. So maybe he would be better. And then Peach, come back here. Go like that. That's still not gonna heal him. Okay, I'm awful. All right, well, I guess it really doesn't matter where she lands. I guess the closer to him, the better, because the more of a chance we can land some good damage. Can she throw a duck? She can't throw a duck, but she can do this. So boom, hit him. Rabbit Mario still hasn't moved, right? Rabbit Mario's at 147 health though, so I don't know if I want him to move. Unless we can get him somewhere really good, like positionally. Like, what if you did that, and you did that? Or I could just have you go through the pipe. Where does this pipe lead? Over here. Hmm. I mean, if I do get blasted, it's gonna stink. Well, it's not gonna stink super bad, because the ice cube thing isn't that big of a deal. And then, you're definitely, I mean, I guess you really don't receive too much more damage than you would've. Okay, but it was a critical, that's nice. All right, Mario, your turn, just blast him. Yeah, just straight up blast him. And that's his turn done. And it was another critical. We are definitely winning next turn. I don't see how we cannot get this done unless some crazy shenanigans happen. But he's gonna keep attacking Peach, which I'm totally fine with. He's gonna call some teammates. Okay, so somebody's gonna have to get blasted here, and obviously I think it's gonna have to be Peach. Um, which is totally fine again. Cause like, she has plenty of health, she can handle it. Even if it is a critical, which is not. He doesn't hit for very hard at all. So now the Peach is you know, on our team. I mean, she was before, but. um, We might be able to finish him very easily here. Like, let me just move up to him. Maybe I should do that last, because Mario could get hit by the blast. Let's move you here. And then, we could hammer. Yeah, let's hammer. Boom, and then Mario's just gonna do the same thing. I mean, he doesn't even have to. We just won, we just won. Just like that, gotcha. So there we go, World 2's final boss is now completed perfect this time. Better combo when I have my characters more leveled up. Of course, it wasn't too bad. I mean, I guess we're not quite done. I keep forgetting about this part. It's so weird to me, and that's why. Um, And nobody can really do anything about it this turn, huh? Okay, well, we'll just wait here and wait for the turn to end, and then that'll be it. 
because, yeah, they just, they can't do anything about it. So Mario, help us out here. Ma -ma -ma Mario, Ma -ma -ma Mario, we got you. Hooray! Wait a minute, weren't you? No, you weren't frozen. So now it's, totally, now it's the same cutscene as with Rabid Princess Peach. At least we're getting something a little different because of it. And then she's gonna punt it again, which I'm totally cool with. She's got quite the kick on her. She's so cool. So let's see how this cutscene might be different with Rabbit Luigi popping out. I wonder if Rabbit Mario could be gotten there as well. I guess not, because Rabbit Mario is so strong, I don't think they'd want to leave us out of him. We are honored to have you join us, Uroa. Okay, so we already saw this. I guess really nothing too much changes. It just gives us a weird look. Okay. So there we go. We have completed World 2 perfect. We didn't get all... Well, never mind. Well, never mind. I guess I'm doing it again. Yay! I might, you know, maybe I'll do that another episode because I really need lunch. I think that's where we're still gonna finish things off. Cause you know, we tried really hard. If we do do, <laughs> do do, if we do actually do missions next episode, you can let me know in the next, or in the comment section. Let me know if you'd like to see missions done, but for now, thank you guys so much for watching today's episode of Mario Rabbids Kingdom Battle. If you want to support the video, make sure you comment Zebra Peach so I know you've watched at the end and that you are a Zebra-tastic viewer. If you enjoyed today's episode and you want to see more like it, feel free to click on any of the videos on your screen right now or subscribe to join the Zebra Herd. Either way, thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.